Hello. So Alan and I were just talking about, um, we spent a lot of time in bed because I'm still, okay, I probably should have gone to New York, I know, but it was so great, wasn't it? And I looked cute, didn't I? I had cute outfits. And the book went to number 16 after two days, and now it's at number one in its category. And it's on, on a lot of lists. Yay! I know. And um, so oh, what were we just talking about? You're asking me? Yeah. Your, <laughs> your feet being you. dog tired. My feet are dog tired. Yeah. So, okay. So I know I probably should have worn high heels mm -hmm. with a crutch. You did wear high heels. I probably shouldn't have, I oh, said. I thought you said should. should. No. And I got a lot of you told me, you reprimanded me. I shouldn't have worn high heels. No, no, but, but you know what? You look great. I know. So that's high what they're, they're all crutch. being me. <laughs> <laughs> and I, I um, you know, I'm Suzanne Summers. And my, my brand is I wear short skirts and high heels, and I love them. And I couldn't imagine walking onto the Today Show in flats. I couldn't. You're not a Dooney Burke girl. I'm not. I'm not. So... Um, so here's what I did. At the airport, they arrange um, wheelchairs. It's nice. So when you're in a wheelchair and you have a crutch, everybody thinks you're some rich lady who is skiing in Aspen. <laughs> I, nobody asked me. I just presumed that that's what they presumed. And so I thought, yep, rich lady in Aspen skiing. <laughs> you notice how nicely everybody treated you? They did. They didn't treat you normally like Suzanne Summers walking through the airport? No, they were really, like, really nice. They treated nice. you like some poor, pathetic woman in a wheelchair mm -hmm. with a crutch. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But your book is doing great. Yeah. It's so great. It's the in best fact, can book. you hand it's me a book right book there? It's the best book you've ever written. I yeah. don't know. I Yes, it probably is. No, it is. It is. It's I've probably written the, all. It's probably the best book I've written, but you know what? I was telling Caroline this. I think... The people are finally ready to hear. And that's what I felt with every audience. When I sat there and I'm saying, you know, I'm 73. That, that resonated with people like, oh, and I'm liking it. I'm really enjoying it. And I've got nice hair. I swear it means more. It's about your freaking hair. No, it means more to them out there than to me too. Because the one thing, the one thing, those of us have always had nice hair, don't think we'll ever lose is our hair. But one of the things that you know, I with do. the stringy hair, and you had it for a while, uh, when your hair's bad. Terrifying. Yeah, yeah. And I've had to take a lot of medication in the last two months, and I've been, like, taking a lot of hair out of my brush, which really bothers me. So I have loaded up on um, hair, skin, and, hair, nail skin and, nail. and nails, and I highly recommend hair, skin, and nails. You know, I saw a woman on television. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm who was a rather prominent attorney, and she had really bad hair. Mm. Let's and not say was, her name. No, we'll see. I don't remember her name. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, and I was so tempted to send her not only hair, skin, nails, mm -hmm. but also the <laughs> um, true Brazilian. Oh, the true Brazilian. Oh, my God. Because you gave the that activating. to oh my God. You, another famous oh my God. lady. We won't mention yeah. her name. Yeah. You gave it to her. Yep. And uh, the results were amazing. Yep. Yeah. I was going to do that. I started it when I got home, when I got home on um, Friday night, because my hair was taking a hit in New York and uh, all this medication I've had. So I started, I, I'm taking four a day now. I was taking one a day because my hair was great. Now I'm taking four because my nails are a little on the short side. I've always taken four and I think I always will. Yeah, it really works. It's all, all that stuff in there. Do you but, take care of nails what? first? No, do I need it? <clears throat> no, you have hair, you have skin, and you have no, nails. Yeah, you're yeah. good. I got lots of skin. Yeah, you do. And lots of hair. <laughs> but, you, you know, so today, in what? addition to screaming your praises over A New Way to Age, I love this which is still climbing and still available, and thank you so much for everyone who has written in and left thank comments you. about wow. how great the book is, book please here? do us a favor and go on to Amazon and please leave oh. a review on Amazon. Oh, would you? That would really be helpful. Oh, would you? God, yes. that would help Please, so much. It really helps for people who don't oh, know here. Suzanne the way you guys do. Thanks, Bruce. It really helps for those of you who have the book and have read it to leave a comment. Great. It really, um, that, she, Caroline is so right. I never ask, I don't like to ask people to do anything for me, but that would really be 
Except so Alan yeah, to except do the, everything. Alan, Unless that can you scratch my nose? Alan. Can yeah. you scratch my nose and get me that tissue? And can I not send this to Victoria and Joe? <laughs> oh, you wanted me to send them each both. So, oh. Okay, can so. Any of you are out there, Victoria and Joe. I have one personalized to you right here. <laughs> <laughs> Alan doesn't like me to send one book to two people. So, wow. um, Holly, the book is not sold out. It is available. Oh, no. You can, uh, we post the link on Facebook all the time mm -hmm. um, or Instagram. So there are so many different places that you can order it. Um, and so, and thanks so many of you for jumping in and doing that. And thank you well, for your comments. Well, that means so much to me that you would do that to write the yes. review. Write the review on Amazon. I think you, you have to have purchased doing it that, on Amazon. You can jack up the, um, uh, the it's rating. I'd, I'd love this book deserves to be number one. I'd love it to get to number one. I'd love that. And we have a special guest here tonight. Oh, yeah. Come here. She doesn't like me all that much. I'm the mother. The Look grandmother. who's here. Oh. I find when you rub their bellies, they mm -hmm. get kind of... You got her? Yeah, yeah got me too. Her. I got her. Okay. Mm -hmm. There's Chi-Chi. Okay, Chi-Chi. It's okay, baby. Chee -chee. It's okay baby. Your grandparents are here. Yeah, we're your grandparents. How long do I have to endure this? <laughs> <laughs> See, but when you when you face them out Jesus. and you hold their butt or bottom legs, they feel safe. Mm -hmm. I no, found that with my cats. Paralyzed. Oh, this is the Can't this move. is the longest. That's sweet. You've ever let me hold you. Yeah, Chi -chi. and then she also likes being up on your shoulder. That's another position. But she no, likes. it's only you. She only likes your shoulder. I've tried. Yeah, because you know what? She does like to see me. Like yeah. this way, she can at least see me. She can see you. But when I put her on my shoulder, she goes, you're not my mom. We also have another special guest here. Oh, it's yes. not just Chi Chi. And it's not just no. Zanny and Zeta. Guess what? <laughs> <laughs> hey, Brucey. It's my husband. Uh, How are you? My Hi, son. everyone. <laughs> what are you doing in our bit? I, I know. It's weird. It no. is weird. No, weird ass family. That's no, weird. No, weird ass here. family. That's what it is. Here. And Suzanne had these no, beautiful no, no. appetizers Mark. brought up to bed. So we're having cocktail yeah, hour in the bar. Sauce. That will be the last time Chi Chi yeah. eats. Yeah. <laughs> and she'll decorate Sweetie, the, will you the take rug. Them? You know, my feeling um, is, my feeling is um, uh, life happens, right? And so... She means shit happens. Yeah, I do. I do. And so with... You got to adjust to the shifts. Cover the... Okay, it's not green. <laughs> hey, no, there was some green, some pink. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, okay. Hot pink. It looked good. Okay, but my underpants <laughs> match my kimono. They do. Which was a dress. I'm now sick of it as a dress, so it's now a kimono to wear when I'm in the mood for my pink silk quilt. I have to say that the pink silk quilt is not mine. It's not? It's glorious. The cat. Oh. Oh. And, 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 and what's nice about it, it's lined... In magenta, I'm mean, not magenta. In uh, tangerine. tangerine, and so this is Gloria's quilt. I had to. Gloria is sleeping in my suitcase right now. She's been in there for four days. Yeah, because I came home from New we York. We have to put it away. Poor thing. She thinks I, you're I, leaving. I, she does. So the, the yeah. suitcase is out, and I haven't been it's able good, to walk good around. To keep her on her toes. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't been able to walk around, and so I didn't put the suitcase away. So she's just sitting in that suitcase like. Don't, you got me last time. You're not leaving without me again. So, uh -huh. but I had to sneak the quilt out from under her so I could dress our bed. To so I, I just want to say it's yeah. been a long time since we've been on Facebook Live, although yeah. we've and, yeah. and and IGTV. But we have um, seen so much of you in all these interviews, mm -hmm. which have been great. But I just want to give everyone a preview of okay. what the deal is today, so that okay. we can continue chatting. But I know a lot of you are eager to know what the deal is. We have. Two different kits today. We have a four-piece hand and foot restore kit and a six-piece hand and foot restore kit. So Suzanne's going to go through these products for you, but we have younger hands for those nasty age spots. And for those of you who have like thinning kind of veiny hands, it's got Me. some great fillers in there. Me, um, we also have two products for your feet, the Refreshing Foot Mist, which is a cool mint fragrance and it's a natural deodorizer, and it just feels good when your feet are hot and tired. Suzanne used it all the time in New York. Also, the Coconut Moisture Serum, which is great for calluses, great for hands and feet, just to get that extra moisture. Moisture And Heal Restore, which is amazing for 
ugly cracked heels and calluses, and Alan's going to use that on Suzanne. In the eight-piece kit, you also get the hand wash and the hand lotion in the lemon verbena. So that's coming up. But we want to hear more about New York. Tell well, us fun things about New York. Well, we were in New York talking about this book. <laughs> what book, Alan? it to a national audience. And Suzanne did about 50 appearances during the week. 50, 5 -0. Radio, print, mm -hmm. television, online, etc. And I just have to say one thing about this book. Mm. If you love America, you'll buy this book. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> this book was written Don't by... Don't be manipulative, Al. This, bo <laughs> this book was written by an all-American girl. I, I mean, am. Look, this is an all-American girl. <laughs> okay? She loves uh, America. I do. She's I do. Irish. I am. Okay? She swears. I do. You should hear did her you know swear. That? Oh, you yeah. didn't know that about me, did you? It's, you know, when we're with my me. father was Ducky Mahoney. Oh, we yeah. know just that. Grow up swearing, right, Bruce? Yep. Yep. <laughs> yeah. His it's... grandfather was Ducky Mahoney. You just learned to swear around Ducky Mahoney. Yeah, you should see the look on people's faces when we're with people for the I first time. I try not to. And all of a sudden, <laughs> one of those words comes I out. I try of... not to. They're seeing Chrissy I'm actually, Snow. No, I'm actually working on it. <laughs> I know you are. I'm working on it because it's like a knee-jerk thing. Yeah. And I'm going to try to stop I'm swearing. I'm actually swearing more. <laughs> You're swearing more? I'm swearing more. I think it's a good release. Is I think it? it's a good way to like... I'm not swearing at people. No. It's a... Something that really I, cathartic yeah. about... The F word is super cathartic. Yeah. Well, you know, it's not when, like you and I are the only ones using it. No, yeah. but when Bono, when Bono <laughs> right. used it on yeah. one of those award shows, uh -huh. and uh, the network freaked out, mm -hmm. what they decided was because uh, he used it as an adjective rather than to describe the act, it was okay. Oh. Oh, interesting. Yeah. Well, so yeah. If you use it as an adjective or an adverb. Yeah. It's fine. Um, okay. I'm, hold on, I have you to answer a quick case? question. Karen, um, can you still get a signed book? If you go back to the Facebook Live where Suzanne did the live signing, there is a website that is attached to yeah. that post. It's on Facebook. So just scroll back a few posts to where Suzanne is doing the I'm live white signing. I'm hat and I'm wearing our, our killer um, necklace. Yeah. So what you, do we call that necklace? The Queen's necklace. Oh Queen, my God. Yeah. So do we you, have any of yeah. those left? That's where you, I think we have one left. Oh my God. That necklace. Yeah. I wore that necklace and in New York I wore that necklace. Fudge. And Chris Shaw says, fudge. <laughs> Everybody Actually, assumes my necklace is real. You know what? I remember, what? I remember the website that people should go to to get a signed copy. What is it? It's premiercollectibles.com backslash Summers. Except it's forward slash. And you kept saying backslash, and I kept trying to text you that well, it was it depends what forward slash. Thing you're standing on. It's forward <laughs> slash These are the things that happen when I'm not nearby. He was so happy just to know. Why? Just... It's the only slash Why do you leave us, Caroline? Used. Why do you leave us? <laughs> if, if you didn't leave us, we wouldn't make it. But I'm impressed that you remember mistakes. it, even though it was incorrect the first Premier time you said it. It has an E after it, which I don't understand. And by the way, you had a little trouble with it that day. That's well, because I thought that's. Well, it's, it's what did they long. say? Why did they go a new way to age backslash summers? Right. Because it's like SuzanneSummers.com. You have to get to your site and then it's like slash hand and foot kit. Anyway, it's so no, it P R E. -R -E -R everyone, I E R E. Change what you're doing. Collectible, C O L L E. And she knows everything. I B O E. Come on, all seven. Forward million. slash or backslash, whichever it goes that way. There's only goes Try one that. way. Summers, S-O-M-E-R-S. -E you can get an autographed copy. Heather ordered her from Premier. Good what? job, Heather. Heather ordered from where? From Premier. Okay, Heather. Based well, on your excellent recitation of the email address. Well, Thank happy. You. Yeah. Well, I was really happy with the reaction to the book. And I was wondering why. I would like to toast you. You would? All right. On another great job. Yeah. Thank you. Great information. Yeah. Helpful to the world. Helpful like to, to yourself. You helpful to the family. Mm -hmm. Helpful to everyone. And you guys are part of our extended family. I literally read the book on my way home from Boston. Wow. Have to cheers, everyone. And, wow. and I took, I had notes and tags and I, ha I have many notes 
And I have about six new supplements in development right now based on your book. So happy for about you. That. Yes. I was like, so wait, why are you sending that. them to Nature's Formula? I, we can make that. <laughs> <laughs> well, when I write a book, I don't try to write a book with an agenda. I don't That's what I love about you. I do. I turn it into an agenda. <laughs> I try to write a book that um, if we make it, great. If we don't, here's where you can get it. Because I think it's very frustrating when you read a book and you go, wow, I want to do that. And then you can't do it. That's why, you know what's incredible about this book? The whole back of the book here right. is all the tests. All the tests that I talk about in there, it's all here. And where to call, where to get them. It's, it's, I mean, it's really, wow. that's exciting. Cause Jill Copeland ordered five books. Oh. One for me and four for my dear closest friends. Wow, that's someone who you care wow. about your health and wow. your friends. That's so nice. And you know my sister Maureen, who doesn't mm -hmm. like anything unless she likes it? She ordered ten for her Wow. Friends. Patricia read it in two days. Bruce, Maria just one? got it. She's so happy. Oh, I'm so happy. Can we post Dr. Oz and Bravo? I believe we have posted. Wow, I think they're both posted, Paula, but I will Dr. check. Dr. Oz is the classiest guy on TV. Such a good guy. And he's Dr. so well informed. He's yeah. so well informed. When I said to him, do you know how long? I said, do you know the GI tract is approximately the length of a tennis court? He said, yes, it's, it's actually 26.7. Um, <laughs> yards. He knew exactly. He just... 26 yards? No, I'm not saying it right because I'm drinking tequila, but you know, he said it right. <laughs> Do you have he to, like, he, ha he had a more specific answer yeah. to... Normally when Suzanne says that, you go, people okay, go, like, go, really? Yeah. But it's a doc he's a doctor and yeah, he's he Dr. Ross. So. Yeah, right. yeah. Anyway, he's a great guy and... Um, oh, he, he, oh, uh, I do have to tell you guys something. Yeah. Okay, go ahead. What I... I, what I really admire about, thank you, Bruce, what I admire about Dr. Oz is I'm not a doctor. I Can you imagine how annoying I am to doctors who went to all those years of school, all those years, and then they go back, if they're going to go into this kind of medicine, to do more schooling, to do uh, this new kind of integrative kind of medicine. And can you imagine then this, and they like to do this to me, this actress comes along and starts telling you what's what when did you become an actress you have an actor for I have, 40 years i haven't i haven't but i could in a minute if Except I, with if me. I if i needed to tomorrow i could tomorrow you've acted with me and goat I, boy I, is ordering tonight I with you? Oh, you put on oh, a he's ordering tacos goat boy. <laughs> i don't do that bruce i don't wear the I, I don't care if you do it's just creepy yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay weird ass family continues How but i have I to interject cool son i don't so i have cool. to interject for a moment okay please do those if of you, you love america those of you who ordered <laughs> gut renew superfood protein formula we have had such a blowout response to this product that we launched like right after the new year. It is also in our oh, January. Up, it is also in our January. Doing something here. It's also in our January selects box, and we had a delay in manufacturing, and it is we're just starting to ship out those boxes. So I apologize profusely for the delay. We just had a huge response to it, plus a minor delay. Very sorry about that. If your box is delayed, you should be receiving an email. Um, We're so sorry and, about yeah, that. Yeah, I'm very sorry. It's a brand new product. It's super exciting. So um, apologize okay. for the delay. Okay. And we have to order a buttload more because we're gonna we, we're almost sold out of that already. Which product? The brand new Gut Renew oh, Superfood. Oh, my God. Yeah. That is like... Gone through yeah, and the manufacturer's That's, like, are you bloated and constipated and you got gaining weight? You can't explain. And that's and everybody. That's every everybody's got something wrong with your stomach. Get our gut renew. It is like going through the roof. Everyone yeah. is crazy about it. But as I said, you got to. Caroline, wait. you did a, You worked with the formulator on this. Let's. Hats off. I you. did. I'm just letting you guys know. She's telling you to get it, but right now there's a delay. So I'm apologizing <laughs> oh. for the delay. Well, but it's because it's in so there. incredible. Yes. It's it's incredible. It's incredible. Yeah. It's got Chris everything in there that that'll fix it. Christine um just bought the audio version of the book. Oh. Suzanne, there is an audio version. It is not narrated by Suzanne yeah, Summers. It's narrated by a very nice um a, a very nice voiceover Broadway, actress. A Broadway actress. Yeah. 
I, I'm sorry I didn't do the voiceover. <laughs> I saw you I posted a comment. What did I say? Some people were like, I can't believe Suzanne didn't do the voiceover. Why didn't you do it yourself? Or you should have had Caroline do it. Who I is this voice? What. This wait, is very wait, disappointing. Wait, and I, can tell you and I see Suzanne. <laughs> Not only Suzanne's, it's like this alternate account that she has that like no one even knows it's her and she's like oh give me a break for god's <laughs> sakes i've got I, a fractured hip and i was on tour like yeah, i had had it i had had it with everybody picking on me <laughs> <laughs> so funny uh, uh, but if you want to listen the information yeah, is in yeah. there and she does have a lovely voice even though it's, it takes it takes days to audio record a book Do you know do you know, I, at one point, what, what book were I was recording? Break okay, I have to tell a story. Okay. Oh, tell and a story, I have, I have carrot in my mouth, so All right. if I spit out well, some we'll, orange things, it's yeah. only carrots. Okay. And then we're going to do Younger Hands. Yeah. Stay tuned. It's coming. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. So years ago, we were doing one of Suzanne's books, audio book, mm -hmm. Okay. And we're in this small stage in Hollywood somewhere. Studio. I'm in the control room. Yes, yeah, studio. I'm mm -hmm. in the control room with the sound guy. Mm -hmm. And Suzanne is in the studio. And I've been working all day at Step by Step. Right, right. And she was really tired. And we had worked all weekend doing personal appearances. That's right. And she's sitting on a stool with the book in front of her and a microphone. And that's it. And I'm reading. And all of a sudden, I hear silence. And I look up, <laughs> and Suzanne was asleep. <laughs> <laughs> That's when I said, you know, audiobooks ain't going to work for us. <laughs> I literally was reading going, <laughs> yeah. Silence. Okay. Yeah. Well, Al feels we don't make a lot of money doing audiobooks either, right? What? You feel we don't make a lot of money doing audiobooks? Well, that's not the reason. No, it's not that's the just reason. That's just one of the reasons. Oh, one of the reasons. Okay. Can you put some goat cheese I'll tell you, I with would, chopped what? olives on a cracker for me? And a little more generous with the chopped olives than you were a moment ago. Okay. How about having cocktail parties in bed? It's great. I mean, I hey. haven't been able to go to Big Al's bar since I got back from New York. How about, that's, you know what, I have, here's, here's. Is this enough olive? Thank you. I appreciate it. I don't like my hands. I like being 73. I like my weight. I like my hair. <laughs> um, I like pretty much everything about being 73. I don't like my hands. I have my mother's hands, and I love... Why do I say that? Because I loved my mother's hands. They were sort of... That's because they were on your mother, not were, on you. <laughs> that's right. They were soft. They were wrinkled, but they were soft, and they were my mother's. And I remember when she passed my nephew, Billy, the, one of the things he said in his eulogy to her, um, he said, the privilege of holding Grammy's hand when we were crossing, crossing the street. Aww. And I thought, how absolutely beautiful. Anyway... There are a couple things you can do, and I've been doing them. All right, okay, I've got some. My nails aren't good right now because of all the medication. My hands have, you know, my mother's Plus like. Plus the dishes. And I do do a lot of dishes. But younger hands plumps them up. You know that old expression? What? I don't From know. dishes to douches, I'm always in hot water. That's wow. a 50s expression. <laughs> Time's up, Al. <laughs> what, what, what is that? What? What? You can get it out. People, women really don't douche anymore. That's I what I. Was, <laughs> I said it was a fifties expression. Okay. Yeah. And we should take a survey. <laughs> Let's take a survey. That's my right now. Alan, That's younger my hands. Younger what? hands. <laughs> That's what we're talking about right now. Younger, younger hands. hands. Stop talking about douches. Yes. You brought it up. It was just I'm just saying. One liner. There was something that remember younger. our mothers used to douche. Younger hands, there was guys. something really scary about our mother's My mother douching. Never douche. God. You'd go into the bathroom and there'd be some contraption. Reduces age spots. Hanging there. My mother, there. My mother has organic line fillers. 
Do you she realize my mother had never been to a doctor until two <laughs> weeks before I was born? Oh, and he's never gotten over it. Did, Did you, you know that, that Crest Sprout Extract reduces <laughs> age spots? Well, that's in this younger hands. What is the plumping, though? The plumping is that's what's the, so incredible. It's the lipo filling. We have biocontrolled what lipo happens, filling. The reason I have my mother's hands is that so she's there's, mother. there's no plumping. And so all that's left are the like veins and things. But you, you know your thin gets your skin gets a little thin on your hands. Yeah. Like you can see my veins a little. Yeah. So this has those it has organic line fillers and an organic plumping agent. That helps to thicken up that skin, and the Cress extract is going to help reduce age spots, which is lovely. And you know what's great about going out with a book going, I am 73. It's you can have your mother's hands, and people go, well, she looks good. Her hands are like a little bit, but she's 73. 73 is the most liberating age I've ever been. I was telling Alan today, um, women don't hate you anymore when you're 73, because they go, huh, eh, she's, 70, she's 73. <laughs> Men aren't afraid of you anymore because eh, you're 73. And um, there's just a lot of advantages to being 73. So look forward to being 73 and older. I look forward to it because um, every year I get older, my brand gets better because we're all in this. We're all in this together. Denise says the Younger Hands has a lovely scent. It is an amazing it hand does. cream. It's like, it's Do you like know who brand. orders more hand cream? Than anyone I know of in the entire world. Stephen Hamill. Oh my God. Stephen <laughs> Hamill. Really? Oh, oh, you can't imagine. Stephen right. Hamill orders like three a quarter. Yeah. Stephen Hamill? Oh, oh, you can't imagine. <laughs> hand cream? Oh, God, yes. So much hand oh, cream that I actually emailed him and said, wow, your hands must look really good. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. What's he doing with it? Who knows? <laughs> but I see all his orders and I go, whoa. Maybe he's <laughs> using it off label. Maybe, maybe. Yeah, He's so, selling so well. it on eBay. Oh, or selling it, yeah. Selling it, yeah. <laughs> Did you know I have a new book? But you yeah, know what? He spends America. he spends a lot of time in China. Yeah, so they, all they care about it is It might be, there. yeah, They you got to make all sure you have no age spots yeah, on your hands. No sun on your hands in China. In China. Yeah, Absolutely. Youth is everything in China, like to, the, to a degree that you want to go, okay, I'm sorry, but it's like um, stuff happens. Anyway, oh, Linda some... Johnson says, I overuse the younger hands because of the smell. I love it. Oh. And Terry said, I'm reading your book. Love it. So Thank much you. information. Thank you. Paula Gregory loves your products. They Thank have you. the nicest smell. Thank you. Bridget is getting the hand cream tomorrow. Mm -hmm. um, I want to just quickly, we have a couple more, pro we, have, we have a lot more products to show you, but I got to show you guys the deal because it's been so long. The four piece I, hand and yeah. foot restoration kit is younger hands you get the refreshing foot mist the heel restore and two ounces of the coconut moisture serum 115 dollars value you get it today for just under 65 dollars this is a 57 percent uh sale like 57 percent off it's huge if you get the six piece kit you also get the hand wash and the hand cream. It's in the lemon verbena scent. This is 63% off. So everything's available at SuzanneSummers.com. You get the better deal if you get the six piece kit, 63% um, off, that's huge. We never go 63% off. So I hope you can get those products home. You, know you wanna move on to the- Yeah, but I was, I was, this room, uh, I'm about to do a podcast with somebody I met on the tour last week, Steve Forbes. Um, Forbes magazine, right? Incredible businessman. And he wants me to do his podcast for an hour and a half about business, me about business. But then I realized, you know, um, I'm probably the perfect person to talk to about business because I am appealing to all that we're thinking about these days. That's what this book is about. This book is about how to age a new way and, um, not be all loaded up on drugs if you don't have to be. Well, speaking of which, if yeah. you could answer this, Judy Pasquale, Pasqualone mm -hmm. said, I'm reading your book now. Geez, so sick of reflux issues. Mm. Hoping this will be my guide. Mm. A lot of good our, information. How about our, um, our uh, gut renew kit? And also, I have this here. I just threw it into my garbage can because I put it in a little thing. You really, if you've got digestive issues you really want our um, H A H L H C L with pepsin hydrochloric acid which is pepsin. in the kit with the gut renew yeah. so well 
That's right. That's okay. a new product. The one that's yeah. on back order. This is right? awesome. But this wow, is, awesome. is that an amazing And you want it with Pepsin. Okay, so my feet are a little tired. Why don't I put a little refreshing? Would you like me to do your feet? Would you do my feet? I'd be happy to. Here, here's the foot mist. How great is that? So the first thing that Alan's going to put on Suzanne's feet is mm -hmm. this refreshing foot mist. It has organic peppermint oil. It has organic deodorizers. And it just, it gives your feet like a tingly freshening. So it's great to refresh tired feet. Makes them not so stinky. If you're, stinky. Yeah. If your dogs are tired, it's a, good, it's a good thing to do. And by the way, I'm a little swollen. I, I have little legs, but my little legs, if you look at the two of them together, this one is more swollen than that one. This, this is the one Not with the lot. fractured hip. Not a lot. But my, like my, my foot hurts and my ankle hurts and it's all hurts. And I just want you to put something to like... This is this uh, will refresh your foot. Uh, that feels so good. That's okay. enough. Okay. Oh, that feels so now, good. Now, where's the... Uh, the Heal Restore is the other product you want to use. Here, Suzanne has it right here. here. Yeah. Okay. Because I walk around here barefoot all the time because if you read in my book about earthing, about picking up the electrical charge from the from the earth and we've stopped that charge by wearing rubber shoes so um, this is heel restore yeah. which is amazing for if you've got calluses okay. if you've got cracked heels if you just don't take very good care of your feet do you know how what good care he's taken of me for the last two months really amazing alan this is really. as hard as it's been on suzanne i know it's been i bet very hard, hard on I bet you harder yeah but you know you have to do that because who's going to cook and clean for me <laughs> 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 my sister who's totally honest she uh, prays for you every morning Aww. and you're taking such good care of her sister you have and so many people jumping in about how much they love heal restore the, the six piece kit, you guys, is 63% awesome. off today. It's a huge discount. For those of you who follow us, you know we rarely go to 63% off. Usually 50% off is our biggest. Um, but this is a six piece kit. You get the hand wash and the hand lotion and the lemon verbena, the coconut moisture serum, which is amazing like for toes. so many parts of your body, but hands and feet especially. They're my favorite toes. He likes my toes. I have such long toes. Look how long my toes are. Yeah, these toes. They are. Look at them. When I was a kid. She can hang from trees. <laughs> she has halo on, for those of you wondering. Yeah. When I when I was a teenager, I was so mortified of my toes that I wore socks in the pool. Socks in the pool? That's kind of embarrassing. Yeah. That, that's not a great look. No, but that's how mortified I was by having the longest toes. And boys, young boys, are mean. And they would say, look at her toes. She's like a monkey. Do you know what this one boy said to, Susan, to Violet? What? On the bus one day. What? Okay. You're good. Um, he said, you have no good parts. Violet? Mm -hmm. Violet with every good part? She was in seventh grade. Oh. And he was like, you have no good parts. And she was like, What? And, you know, the boys had a rating system. Oh. Right? Oh. F you, oh. boys. And have any of you, and then of course, have any of you ever <laughs> seen Violet? Oh, my God. Yeah, she came home and she was crying. Oh. I won't say his name because he's so sweet now. It was just yeah, a teen. It was just a he tweener really boy thing to say. Nice. And she was like, he said, I have no oh. good parts. Oh, Oh. Right? When you think, you know, as a young woman, that you're judged you, on right. your boobs and how nice right. of an ass you right. have. And do you have great legs? Right. And do you have, I, I mean, right. wow, that was really hideous. Well, it was a teaching moment. My favorite song. Guess who had, oh, you're, oh, were we about to sing the same song? Guess who had the last laugh? Yeah. <laughs> I was just going to sing, ho, ho, ho. <laughs> Who's got the last laugh now? I was just going to say that. She has some... Screw them. Yeah. You know what? No, you know what? It's that, all about the winning, ladies. said that was insecure. Yeah. Exactly. He was just a... He was insecure. Yeah. He was trying to put her down to make himself... Feel better. Feel better. Exactly. Okay? You know I have a new book? Hmm. New Way to Age. I'm so if proud of If you love America... <laughs> <laughs> Please write a review for Amazon. You're all my friends. That would mean so much to me. Really would mean a lot to me. Thank you. This is the best book she's ever written about mm -hmm. aging. Mm -hmm. 
Really? Charmed Healer is having her birthday oh. on the 18th. She wants to know how she can get your book of poetry. Oh. Do we have any? I don't think we have any on our site, Charmed no. Healer. No, no, I don't think so. But it's available on... Uh, I think you can find it on... eBay. Mm-hmm. And also, uh, if you don't find it on eBay, the New York Times has a thing called Book Finder. Oh. And you pay $25 or mm -hmm. something. Mm. And they find the book for you. You know what I have to say, though, last mm. week? Yeah, everybody told me, don't go to New York, and you're hip, and you're hip, and don't, and the crutch, and you'll wreck, and you'll wreck, and don't do it, and don't, and don't. I wasn't not going to go. I, was I mean, go. we all knew that. I wasn't not going to And we all go. knew that you were going to be in excruciating pain when you came home. Yeah. And you did, and you are. <laughs> I am. <laughs> you're all right. I'm right, and you're all right. Yeah, you did, and you are. And, and But I have to say... You know, dipping into New York um, f for a week with 50 plus uh, TV appearances, 50, 50, and. Um, well, not just TV. And radio, radio and podcasts. Podcast, every, everything. Online. And TV, because I'm not in. Because I don't live in New York when I'm there. Radar. I'm, um, I'm a new. I'm, I'm fresh meat for them in New York. So every show is very receptive to having me on. And. Um, Oh, That's my. not why they want you on. Why is why they want you? Me? Happen to be the world's greatest guest. Okay. <laughs> Does he no, love me? He it's loves true. me so much because you're well informed. Oh. You know your subject. Mm -hmm. Plus, you're funny. Mm -hmm. And I'm you're funny. and you're as as Dick Van Dyke says, easy on the eyes. <laughs> <laughs> well, did I you have fun with Jennifer Coolidge and Andy? On so Bravo? much fun. Yeah. I love Andy. Sh she's a hoot too. Yeah. Well, okay, here's my honest thing. I do not like being I I'm I live in a world of of aesthetics and pictures. When I'm on home shopping or any of the shopping channels, if I'm working with a really tall uh, co-host, I have no problem with that. But what I do is I have them stack three apple boxes so that I can look at them eye to eye. Because I can't sell to you if I'm looking up at you because you're so much taller than me. So Jennifer was so much taller than she was twice my twice my height and um so i had a hard time sitting in a chair that sunk low and had no back cushion so she was okay ten, you, do you know what i'm gonna tell you 10 inches tall you know what i'm gonna tell you what are you gonna tell me tall women many grow up in those teen years feeling so awkward and so out of place <laughs> and so wish that they could be smaller With because long toes? they feel like guys don't want to date them because they're too tall and they feel like an outcast and you know we all have those places where we feel inferior and we always think that taller is stronger and better but I know so many tall women who will say that was really hard for them to be tall oh no I love tall women you do and short women he loves women and I love fat women too well I really like Jennifer a lot it's yeah. just that I had to look up to her and look around her and find my place in there, but I think I came off okay. And Andy is so mischievous. He's Andy's always trying to like get you to say something you don't want to right. say. Right. And I, I've been on enough times now to where I go, whoa, wait a minute, you're going to that place. <laughs> so when I really want to make a friend, I'm going to a dinner party, I want to make a friend, or I'm going to a lunch, I want to make a friend. You take your pants off. That is so like. What? That's so. Low well, class. I couldn't think of <laughs> I couldn't think of a better way of making a friend. Yeah, turn it, turn it. Okay. We've totally turned on Bruce here. Oh, I was trying to get you over there <laughs> with your oh, eyes God. closed. Yeah. <laughs> How's your weird ass family over here? They're they're rambling. I'm really happy you came with me today. It's so nice. And me too. Yeah. I was happy all day that you two were coming. I know. I was, I was really like, hey, Bruce, yeah. I'm going to do two shows, and you yeah. could come, and then we could have a tequila and, and stay over. And sleep in the pink room. Yeah, the pink so room? Nice. We're downstairs from our bedroom is the pink room, and um, there's, a lot of, there's a lot of earthy things about the pink room. First of all, the quilt on the bed is, is baby skin pink velvet. I love that quilt. Do you know who else loves it? Chi-Chi. Oh, I bet. Chi Chi loves it. What's it. What could be bad about sleeping with a velvet, not just velvet, 
I right. bought dress quality velvet, the kind of the kind of oh, velvet yeah. that you would make a, a a gown out of. I can tell. Yeah, it's like the best because who the, loves the, the pink quilt? Do you huh? love the pink quilt? You oh. love it, don't you? Oh, look at her. So sweet. Oh, you're starting to like me, aren't you? Aren't you? Because I push you out. I hold you on the bottom and I keep you safe. Then I hold you out. This is see? our dog, Chi Chi, guys. She's see. 105. Yeah. She follows Suzanne Summers' anti aging methods, mm -hmm. and that's why she looks so good. Except yeah. for her teeth. She clearly did her not teeth. use Summer Smile toothpaste. Her teeth aren't right. She has to go to bed. She clear, has no tooth. She has no place. teeth. Clear choice, all right? She needs to Wait. go to clear Wait. choice. Clear yeah. choice, she has you no teeth. Wear... Why would she go there? She can get choppers in one day. She has day. two she has teeth. That's she has all. two teeth? She's a Maltese, Jean. You have only two teeth? That's so normally unattractive, but you're so cute. <laughs> So even so with cute. with only two teeth, you've managed to come out cute. So I would count your blessings. You know, we were in Malta. Oh, Remember we were in so Malta? Sweet little girl. Chi Chi's hey. land. Come here. Okay. What? Yeah. Remember when we were in Malta? Remember in Malta. Ba 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 ba. Right. Right. And I, when I was looking oh, forward, I'm getting to, back to this. I was looking forward to looking up my old friend Charles Camilleri. Oh, okay who was the conductor mm -hmm. of the Maltese mm -hmm. Symphony and mm -hmm. guest conductor of several other symphonies. And I'd known him for most of my life. And I actually made his first record deal, thank you, with MGM Records. Uh -huh. Okay. And uh, mm -hmm. he had moved back to Malta. Mm -hmm. He was living in mm -hmm. Canada, they moved back to Malta. Mm -hmm. So when we arrived in Malta, mm -hmm. I went to look him up and he had passed away two weeks before we arrived. Oh. Yeah. Oh, sorry. Someone's asking if you wear a wig. So Me? it's just showing oh. that this is oh, your actual wait, hair. Wait. No, she does not wear a wig. Her hair is beautiful. <laughs> it's incredible. Incredible for any age, but for I'm 73, wow. Well. And um, one of the things I was trying to... And you use hair skin nails. Hair, hair skin, skin nail renew. So one of the things I was trying to say summer's the cover of this book is it ain't over, ladies. It ain't over. And um, there's, I know there's another whole chapter ahead, and now I'm realizing, oh, I'm short-sighted. There's more than another chapter ahead. Each one changes. Each one has its own yeah. kind of hey, vulnerabilities. Alan, yeah. Yeah. Katie Riley wants to know if there's any way to get a signed copy of the book. How could she do that? How okay. can they do that, Alan? Katie, listen carefully. Oh. Go online. And go to Premier Collect <laughs> Mega Premier it is a garbage name. dot com slash mm -hmm. Summers S O M E R S. Wow, Premier good is Premier with an E, oh. and Collectible oh. is C O L L E C T I B L E. You uh, couldn't Premier, remember that the other day. No, I and couldn't. if you look back on our Facebook lives, you will see a video of Suzanne in a white fur hat. Uh -huh. And the link is there. So, and the, and the um, necklace. Yeah, she's wearing the queen, the queen's necklace and the lace hat. And the link is there. So that's where you get the signed book. Otherwise, we've posted all the outlets where you can get it. Um, we post it pretty much on everything that we've posted in the last several days. Um, do I talk enough about this? I don't think so. No, you haven't talked at all about it. Please do. So this well, has than, nine different There's more than coconut oils. in there. There's uh, raspberry seed oil, metaphone seed oil. Um, broccoli seed oil. Right. Um, argan oil. Well, argan, argan oil. oil. Oh, yeah, the three things. Just, argan it's, comes it's from the loaded. Argan Nigella. Tree, right? Nigella oil. This is just loaded. Jello. Loaded. Nigella. This Nigella. Is loaded with Isn't the most. Isn't she a chef in England? Yeah. Is she in England? Ni Nigella, Nigella Lawson? No. There is a... There is a chef. Yeah, she's great. Nigella. Yeah. So, you like her because she has big boobs. Look, <laughs> that's not the only reason I like someone, okay? It could be <laughs> if they have no so other much qualities. Of trouble. Okay? But that's not the only reason I like her. But she's she, an amazing chef. She's amazing a very chef. bright, she smart does, woman. She does make them front and center. And no. they're always there. Well, and they well, how, where, how else can they be when they're on the front of your chest? <laughs> Come on. You know, you know, should here's they the be thing. on the side? You know, here, here's the thing. I have to yeah. tell you something. Yeah. 
So Suzanne was doing a lecture at Harvard. Okay, think about that one. <laughs> Chrissy Snow at Harvard. Okay. Twice. So, twice. So he's doing a lecture at Harvard, and I'm sitting at the back of the room, and this woman who was in her mid sixties, probably maybe maybe older, walks by me, and I couldn't resist. What did you say, Al? I stood up and I said, "You have great legs." Okay. And then I thought, I hope she doesn't sue me. Yeah. It's so crazy what's no going on. No one sues you for saying you have great legs. Okay, Unless it's so your now, boss. Okay, okay. And it's a 20-year-old okay. girl walking by, and okay, you're, she's supposed okay. to be doing a job so for now, you. So now, now we're talking about <laughs> Nigella Lawson with the big boobs in their front and center, right? Oh, my God. If I were to say you have nice boobs, I'd be in prison. Well, that would be super tacky, Alan, and well, you shouldn't say that. So why should I say you have nice legs? I don't get into their huh? back and forth. Alan, right? this What's is Alan and Caroline. Can I just and sit boobs? here and I go? It's no, very really. different. Yeah. If it's okay for me to say nice legs because I see them, why can't I say nice boobs because it's, I see them? It's all with intention. You can say because boobs are inherently more sexual than legs. So you can say, wow, you've got a nice pair of legs if you go. <laughs> you've got nice legs. <laughs> it's fucking creepy. Like you don't say that. So you don't want to be creepy. But boobs, regardless, are just kind of off limits. But you can say you have nice legs with great owl intention, and then it's not creepy. So you can say, like, wow, you've got so great legs. And someone's right. going to say, you're right. that's so nice, Alan. Right. Thank He's you. Right. So and that he just loves center, women she so wants much. people to see them, right? Because they're nice. Right? They're on display. <laughs> But it's part of the they're deal. They're just her boobs. Like, what is she? Does, she, does it mean she has to wear turtlenecks at all times? Oh, now you're wearing a turtleneck. Now you're like, she just has boobs. Yeah. Right. Because they're nice. If they weren't yeah. nice, they wouldn't be on display. You have nice boobs. But how can you not, not make your boobs on display? They live at the front of your chest. Exactly. <laughs> so why can't, if they're nice, why can't I say they're nice? <laughs> how about nice. just saying you look Girls, great? What do you think? I'm not touching them. What do you think? Okay? How about if you just say you look I'm, great? I'm why do you? Have I've to like to my wife. It's not like I'm coming are, on to you, really okay? Are. Yeah, but why do you have to like point out a body part? Why can't you just say you look beautiful? Okay, why? So, no, so, so I, think I, you said, I, I no, like your legs. No, have nice legs. No, let me get, get in Miss there. really, Lana says, don't be a redneck, Al. Yeah. Yeah. And if the, uh, and if the woman uh, had nice uh, boobs too. <laughs> Let me just get in there for a minute. Okay. The, these are generations. Nice legs and nice boobs. These are generations. Um, really, really. Um, I remember the first night you commented on my boobs and you said, Okay, wow, okay. Wow. Well, that was different. Wow, those are beautiful. That was I have to tell you, <laughs> made me feel But really you were good. dating. But you made, were dating. That's different. so good. You weren't we doing an interview. We knew each no. other for 20 minutes. But yeah, you were in great. a, you were flirting yeah. and having a, a mutually sexual, consensual yeah, experience. So like, yes, women love it when you say you have nice boobs when you're interested in him. It's when someone's not interested in you and you're putting that on them. That's so, when it's lascivious. So well, this. we hadn't started the consensual consensual anything okay? <laughs> but you understand what i'm saying there's this a different flir the women love anything. flirting women okay. love flirting if they're interested in you if they're not interested in you it's creepy so okay okay if nigella lawson is watching okay <laughs> would you come online and nigella, say, say it's this. okay for me to say, say nice boobs yeah oh yeah and you probably call them something else what no i wouldn't no okay all right I want to go back to coconut oil. <laughs> and then cook dinner for us. And then it's it's a long way back. What is? Coconut oil. <laughs> oh, right. Okay. So let's just start with I'm Irish. On my jealous. I'm Irish. <laughs> and on the back of my arms, I get like these bumps. Do you get those bumps? You those do? Like, well, I don't have them now because I put this on all the time. But I get these bumps. They're like, what is that? When I put the coconut oil on my arms, um, it just sort of goes away. And then maybe once, maybe twice a week, instead of putting all the creams I have, I put the um, coconut oil on my face and I rub it all over my face. It's not greasy. It just kind of absorbs and, and goes in there. I put it in there. my hair too. It's so, yeah, he puts it in his hair. It's so incredible. When I came back from New York, my hair took a little bit of a hit. Maybe because I've been on the medications and because of the stress of traveling and uh, the 50 shows and all that. You know what I did? I took this. I put this on the bottoms, on the ends of, of my hair. 
So that was yesterday. It's, it's already starting to come back. Yep. It's already starting to come back. Um, when I take my Epsom salt <laughs> bath twice a week, I also put two droppers of this in uh, after the bath is full and just let it float on the top. And then it's an aromatherapy thing. Schindler 53 wants to know if it's good to put on babies. Oh my God. If I had a baby, I'd love to have a baby. I can't wait till your daughter well, starts having babies. I, I know. God, I want babies. You know what would be great about us having a baby? What? We would Nothing. know what to do now. Yeah, we do. Christina okay. Rukavina yeah. thinks well, that Alan is... You have no idea what to do. Yeah. You read all those books of, yeah. you know, written by people who don't have babies <laughs> yeah. as to how to look after your baby. Yeah. And when it's all over, you go, I'm not going to do that. You Listen, can't. Christina Rukavina, yeah. she loves it when people tell her how nice her boobs are. Who? Christina. Christina. She says Caroline's Talk lost to, it. She's with Alan. Talk to Christina. Almost Christina. everyone else agrees with Talk me, Christina. but Christina agrees with you, so I just wanted to Christine. let you know. Talk to okay, Christina. Christina. Thank you very much for that. <laughs> Show them to me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Let's see how You guys knew the wheels were gonna fall off Let's the freaking bus tonight because it's been a while. Do you know Rodney Harrington? <laughs> Rodney Harrington. <laughs> If you want to hear the song, show them to me. Right. Go to YouTube, uh, Rodney God. Harrington. It's great. And he gets every girl in the audience to show him their boobs. It is, and you love him for it. I swear to God, you love him for it. Alan has it on a loop. He, he does. He has it on favorites, on, the, on his toolbar. Favorites. He can just go there and just wash up. He goes, uh, if you, and then Rodney uh, Harrington ends it. If you truly love your country, <laughs> buy Suzanne's book and me. show him your boots. <laughs> all right. They all go, whoa. <laughs> I'm going to re-hit the, the four-piece hand and foot restoration kit. Younger hands, refreshing oh. foot mist, heel restore, and the two-ounce coconut moisture serum. $114.96 value. You can get it today for $64.99. That is a 57% discount. It's available at SuzanneSummers.com. The link is attached right at the top of this post. And then, okay, if I, you want to add the six-piece kit, Suzanne's going to tell you about this hand wash and hand lotion that comes with it. So the six-piece kit is $154 value and 94 cents. You get it today for only $79.99. It's six pieces available at SuzanneSummers.com. And it is, this is 63% off, which is just a massive discount. But we've been gone for a while, so we wanted to do something nice for you guys. And I want to talk about this. It's interesting. I was talking to my... I have a physical therapist now who comes every other day to help me with my hip, to get it like uh, working up to speed again. And uh, he asked if he could use my sink to wash off the CBD um, cream. I was having a massage into the sorest part of my hip. I'm trying to not take drugs, so I'm using, here in California, CBD is without THC is legal. So he's rubbing it. I think, it's, I think CBD That's is true, now legal in all oh, 50 is it, is it? Oh, is it? CBD uh, without THC. Yeah. Legal everywhere. Yeah, okay. Yeah. It's All right. Hemp base. Oh, okay. So he wanted to wash his hands, so I sent him in the bathroom there. And then um, he said, Oh, I love your soap. And I said, Yeah, it's certified toxic free. I said, You know, when I first started selling certified toxic free soap, hand wash and body wash, um, I thought, Why would people carry just soap is soap, right? Uh -oh. think, think about it. You you wash your most private areas with soap. Do you really want to put chemicals in your most private areas? That's why our hand wash, our body lotion, and if you go into on, on the website, our body wash, it's certified toxic free. I feel so good about this. Oh my God! Does this smell so good too? It smells so good. And you get no bad stuff going into your body cells. And it suds. It's a it, they're it coconut suds. cleansers. Yeah. So yeah. Suzanne doesn't use any any chemical surfactants no. because that's usually what is a peg or a paraben. Right. Is the sodium lauryl sulfate. She doesn't use that. She uses coconut right. cleansers. You still get bubbles. They're not huge bubbles, but they're yeah, they're bubbles. It's, yeah. In fact, Deb awesome. um, DM'd me this today. Is a great gift. Yeah, Deb. Deb. Deb, uh, Deb uh, Steitler, I think. Um, yeah, one of our one yeah, of our friends. Yeah, um, she DM'd me to see if you were ever going to make bubble bath, but the the body wash is as close to a bubble bath as we're going to get. Because yeah, I don't think we'll make bubble bath. You can't get copious bubbles when no. you use natural no. bubbling I'll sudsing tell you, agents. We don't charge. Just go to the grocery, uh, the uh, the drugstore and get um, 
Epsom salt, put that in your bath, and then put the Bruce, oil. Can you and Chi Chi come in? The oil. Yeah, it's great. What? Okay, well, we're going to do a family goodbye from bed because it's oh. weird ass family goodbye. So I, I have, have made question. you guys. I have a hold on, I've made you guys Chili Colorado for dinner. So okay. we're getting ready. Okay. Yes. Tell them what Chili Colorado is. Um, it's a beef stew and it's oh. made with, um, you have to roast the chilies, puree the chilies. It's got cumin and oregano and garlic and. Um, yeah, no, it's amazing. I, have, I had pre made the sauce. But it's stewing downstairs. This so. is my daughter-in-law, um, my f friend, my. Um, uh, we're 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 connected. No, it's, a we're, it's a thing. It's a thing, and our company. She's okay. like she's like everything. Well, um, everything. if you guys want to see how I made the chili Colorado, you can go to my Instagram handle at carolinesummers.com. Okay, so we're younger gonna, hands. We're gonna. Yogurt Slime. hands, uh, heal restore, coconut oil, um, the foot refresher, and here's my family. I'm so proud of my family. I love my family. They're all super oh, yeah. smart and super hip. Yeah. And we fight, but I love Alan. Yeah. yeah. Actually, I think you love him more than anybody. Mm. So, <laughs> so difficult. So, so getting back to getting back to Christina's boobs. Come here, come here. Okay. Back to Christina. Christina, 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 you have great boobs. Christina, yeah. you have okay. great. She likes hearing that, so we're okay. allowed to say it because she's given consent. Okay, thank you, Christina. We love your boobs, I'm Christina. Say it. Yeah. You have a great we haven't rack. seen them, you have but an if awesome you think rack. they're great, we think they're great too. Yeah. <laughs> but if you send us a picture, no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> you know who'd be yeah. really great on your boobs? Is that coconut moisture? Totally. Oh, Makes yeah. Makes them soft and perky. <laughs> and I'd be happy to... No, I'm just kidding. Right. <laughs> That's it for today, yeah. guys. Stop we are back, creepy. Right? We yeah. are back yes. tomorrow at 12.30. Your surf dad's creepy. Creepy. Yeah. We have a huge skincare yeah. show tomorrow, yeah. so make sure you join yeah, us Yeah, we're tomorrow. here tomorrow morning. We're going to go eat Chili Colorado. Bruce and Caroline will be here through the night. I'm so, always so happy when they spend the night. I love it so much. They're and downstairs. you love America. <laughs> <laughs> They're downstairs in the pink room in the pink uh, um, velvet quilt. And uh, we can hear and everything then, they say. And then I can rest up here going, <laughs> we listen my children night, are happy. We? I like we my children to be happy. So we can listen in. Yeah, yeah. Oh, the cameras. Oh, but don't tell Love them. you guys. Love see you, you tomorrow. Bye. Bye. This was fun. Bye. We'll see you tomorrow.